Hey friends, welcome back to my channel. First of all, hello side part. Isn't that so cute? My first time doing a side part with a wash and go. I did not film it because I wasn't sure how it was gonna come out, but it actually came out really nice. So let me know if y'all would be interested in seeing a wash and go routine for these popping curls in a side part right here. But that's not what we're gonna be doing today. Today, I'm gonna be sharing all of my current favorite natural hair tools, some accessories, and even some curly girl merch. Like everything that I mentioned in here is actually gonna make a really great gift. It's that time of year, it's holiday season, everybody's getting ready to shop for Black Friday and stuff. So I figured it'd be really cool to share a bunch of my favorites. And now if you are a curly girl, make sure you send this video to your boyfriend or your girlfriend or your mom or your dad or whoever is gonna be buying you gifts so that they know exactly what to get you. These are like things that I genuinely <laughs> really 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 love so any curly girl would be happy to have anything in this video i know that it's facts all right so let's just go ahead and get into it okay so i actually compiled a list of all my favorite things that are actually really really affordable except for the first item that i'm going to share with you right now which is my dyson so yeah this is going to be the most expensive item that i mentioned in this entire video i promise everything else is actually very 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 much affordable this is a $400 dryer but when I tell you that it is absolutely worth it it very very much is it has special technology in there to make sure that it's not gonna fry your hair I diffuse my hair with it now that it's short I diffuse every single wash now at least to get it to stop dripping at least um, and I have no like zero issues with heat damage or anything like that It's just a tool that I really 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 trust I actually had a conversation with my hairstylist about it the other day and she's just like yeah like there's nothing else like it so if you really want to spend some shmoney and make a curly girl very 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 extremely happy or if you just want to treat yourself, like this is it. All right, so next up, we got to talk about this soft hood dryer. This is amazing. So this is something you can use along with your blow dryer. It works with the Dyson as well. Um, but I absolutely love this thing. 14 bucks, okay? How about that? This makes me very, very happy. So whenever I do like perm rod sets, or if I start doing twist outs again, braid outs, all that stuff, you just need your hair to dry a little bit quicker. This is so perfect for that and $14 like I was looking at dryers and the regular ones that are like the stand-up plastic ones that are look similar to the ones in the salon they're so expensive they range from all the way from a hundred to even sometimes up to four hundred dollars for those and I actually don't even trust those and the technology that's within those dryers because those if, if you if you're not careful they will fry your hair so I love the fact that this in itself is so cheap it's actually very comfortable to wear and then I can use it with my Dyson blow dryer that I genuinely trust to not fry my hair so love this this came so in handy for my recent perm rod set if you haven't seen that video you can check out exactly how you use this super easy you literally just plug the dryer into the side turn it on and boom you're good to go but in case you want to see it in actual action I'll link that video up here and in the description box below speaking of a perm rod set this set of perm rods that I got definitely one of my new favorites. I had so much fun with it and I'm already planning on doing another perm rod set a little bit closer to Christmas. I feel like it really gives like winter slash holiday vibes, those like loose like wavy curls and stuff. And I was also able to achieve it heat free. So again, another way that I was able to kind of switch up my hair without having to worry about damaging it. So it was great. I love this pack in particular because it comes with all the sizes. So every color is a different size rod and it just allows you to just have some big ones on top some small ones on the side again if you're interested in seeing that happen in video I filmed that entire perm rod set all right so next up let's talk about my favorite curly hair brush of all time this is the Felicia Leatherwood brush it is I love this it's perfect for detangling styling everything whatever you need this brush got it and it's just it's so good it's a lightweight very simple brush and it has those bristles that kind of move this is like the original brush with this kind of technology 
All the other brushes actually knocked off of this brush, so I definitely suggest you go and purchase like the original one. It's also black and female owned, so of course we stand for that, and it's just genuinely, it's so, so good. I was using another brush, it was called a wet brush that I was using, and then I just tried this out, and I have not gone back to the wet brush ever since, just because it's, it's just that good. I did do a dedicated video actually to this brush. I reviewed it, like all the specifics and everything, so if you want to hear a little bit more in-depth detail about this brush then I will link that up here and in the description box below for you as well but just know just know that I I love it next up is another black owned item that I absolutely love and I've had this now for years like probably at least three years now it is so good so this is the thermal hair care hothead it has beads in here and so basically you put it in the microwave you heat it up and it just takes your deep conditioning to the next level like you'd already have your deep conditioner in you put on a regular you know one of those cheap like clear shower caps you put that on then you heat this bad boy up and put it on on top and it just adds heat to the entire process which helps with the absorption of the product and everything again another way that you can kind of avoid buying those super expensive salon style um, hair dryers for that reason for that purpose you know this is amazing also comfortable to wear and also you're not stuck under a hood like you can walk around and like do things while you're wearing this and deep conditioning your hair love it again like I said I've been using it for years so once you buy one you're good to go unless you feel like you know you want multiple colors for different occasions if you like that then cool go ahead and get some different colors but literally this has lasted me so long and I don't see it you know going bad anytime soon you know what I mean you you buy one and you're done it's, that's it I feel like we are really like breezing through these items but I'm not here to waste your time I'm here to just give you all the tea and let y'all know what's good so moving right along to the next thing let's talk about pattern beauty yet another black owned and female owned brand I personally you guys <laughs> would know if you are subscribed to my channel you know that I've had my issues with their products I have tried over and over again and they just don't work for my curls but what I do really love from pattern is their accessories so first this is their pig this is such a beautiful and extra pick and I know when you think of gifting someone it's kind of like oh just a pick like that's weird but no this one is extra and it's by Tracy Ellis Ross so it would be a really nice gift. Also my favorite pick of all time. So first of all, it comes in this really nice velvet case, which I think is so extra and so cute. And then look at the pick, y'all. Y'all see this? This is huge. I love it for that reason. Like you can get in there, especially if you have like really big, thick hair, like this will get in there. The prongs are longer, I feel like, than a regular pick. The handle is nice and big. It's just a big, thick, good quality pick. Very cute that comes in a very, very nice case. Pattern also carries one of my favorite microfiber towels ever. This thing is massive, okay? It's huge. Huge, huge, huge. And um, so currently with my short hair, whenever I do my wash and goes, sometimes these little hairs back here will kind of drip for a while before they actually start drying. So what I do is kind of just drape it over my shoulders. The cool thing is it only has one straight edge. So this is the one and only straight edge of the towel. The rest of it is rounded. I don't know if you can tell here, but it makes it really easy to kind of just sit on the shoulders like this and just drape over. I just love it. It's huge. Like, yeah, it's massive. So not only would it work for me with short hair, but it will work for anybody with big hair, long hair, whatever kind of hair you got, like this will work for you. And just in case there's somebody in here who's like microfiber, like what is that? Microfiber towels are the best type of towels to use on hair in general. Okay, cotton towels are a no-no. They're super drying and helps to like encourage frizz and all that stuff. You, we do not want that so these are nice and smooth they're super absorbent but they don't like dry out your hair if that makes any sense it's just great microfibers 10 out of 10 like very much necessary for a curly girl okay all right so what do we got next oh so speaking of microfiber so the towel is great and all but if you need your entire head of hair to dry let's say you just finished up a wash and you want your hair to dry a little bit before you go ahead and do your twist out or your perm rod set or whatever this right here is so nice. So this is one of those microfiber hair turbans. You tie it up, it has like a little, um, has a button here. Ooh, I'm like struggling to show this. <laughs> it has a button right here and then a little loopy thing on the other end. So you put it on, you 
twist it around and then you loop the loop around the button and boom it sits on top of your head so you don't have to figure out like how to fold over like a regular towel like no this will lock into place and it'll stay there as long as you need it to and again the microfiber material so you don't have to worry about frizz or your hair getting extra dried out or anything like that love this all right so the last kind of tool that i wanted to mention is this spray bottle this has been my spray bottle for four years y'all okay my entire natural hair journey has been with this bad boy and it has lasted me this long i'm so proud of it because literally i just snagged it from amazon and it's perfect it gives like a really nice mist kind of spray i don't know if the camera is even picking that up but it's not like you know the ones that shoot like pew pew it's the perfect kind of mist to kind of get your hair nice and evenly soaked i love it it's also got the continuous spray mechanism so it's just a perfect spray bottle in my opinion I would never change it or upgrade it to anything else like this is it this is it for me <laughs> so I'll link the exact one that I ordered below because I know all spray bottles are absolutely not made equal and I know it might seem like something that's like so kind of trivial it's like it's a spray bottle but no if you're a curly girl you know exactly what I mean all right, so those are the tools that I love. Now we're gonna move on into some more like accessories. We gotta talk about ponytails. I have two ponytails that are my go-to. Well, they were. My hair currently is not long enough. Well, it might be, I don't know. This thing is growing really, really fast, but I don't think it's long enough for me to pull off a sleek ponytail right now. But when my hair was a little bit longer, I loved to keep these around on a bad hair day. I could just slick my hair back into a bun, stick this on and be fire, okay? So these are my top two curly ponytail extensions. So this one first, this one's a little bit more wavy. Let me get into this texture. But she is long, honey, okay? This is super, super long. But I just love how wavy it is. It's got lots of volume. Y'all know me and my volume. I love some good volume. So it just, I don't know, this makes me feel like a baddie whenever I wear it, seriously. It's so good. You know what? I'll go ahead and insert a picture right here of me looking fire with this ponytail. It just absolutely switches up my look every single time. So love this. This is the Shayla ponytail by insert name here. And then my other favorite ponytail is one that more matches like the actual texture of my hair. Like look at this. Pretty similar, right? I mean, this actually needs a good wash. It's been a while since I've washed it and um, brought the curls kind of back to life. But this is actually natural human hair. It's not synthetic. And I love it. This is by Curly Clips, another black owned brand. And I just, this is just so nice. It's so nice. So here's a picture of me with this ponytail in. She's cute or whatever. So yeah, honestly, I love a good ponytail extension, especially if you have long natural hair. I know the struggle. Ponytails are great to have for those days where you cannot deal with it. You just wanna put it away, but still look bomb. Boom, like, ooh, love it. Actually, that's gonna bring us on to the next item, which is another great accessory for bad hair days. Some nice hair wraps, also black owned, female owned. Do we have a theme going on here? This is one of my favorite wraps ever, 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 ever. Not even for just bad hair days, but if you wanna switch it up a little bit and look real cute, like this is so nice. So it's like this ribbed kind of fabric and it's got a little bit of stretch to it. Also this color, this is my, these are my colors, okay? Earth tones, y'all already know me. So this, you can do so much with it actually, because this is how much, this is folded in half, by the way, okay? So this is how much fabric you actually get with one of their wraps. And they have different types of wraps. They have like the headband ones, they have the ones that are kind of headband, but you still gotta tie them, you know what I mean? They got like, they got turbans, they got everything that you need. I'm still personally trying to figure out like multiple ways to style this successfully because sometimes, I won't even lie, sometimes it's hard to wrap your hair with a wrap, but once you get the hang of it, like it's really nice and like I feel like the possibilities are endless so i definitely suggest okay so let's also talk about my favorite scrunchies ever first of all y'all see the stretch on this thing it's like a really lightweight stretch as well it's not like i just everything about this i love it the material is silk so not gonna dry out your hair not gonna cause any frizz or anything the stretch, I love how lightweight it is, so it's not gonna indent your hair too, too much. I've seen a lot of scrunchies that are a lot tighter, but this is actually more friendly for people with thicker hair, for sure, um, and I just love this. Also, black and female owned, whoo! 
No, but seriously, I love, love, love. When my hair was longer, this right here was my entire nighttime routine. I would just flip up my hair in a pineapple, put this over nice and loose, and go to sleep just like that. And then in the morning, you take it down, shake it out, refresh where you need to refresh, and that is it. I am all about a simple hair care routine. That's one thing I've learned about myself. I do not need it to be complicated. It does not need to have like 10,000 steps in order for it to be a good routine, you know what I mean? Simple is great. Simple is perfect, okay? And this is it for me. This was it. And speaking of nighttime routines, silk pillowcase is going to be my last accessory that I mentioned for you guys. I personally don't like to do like the silk um, scarf wraps at night because they always fall off my head no matter what. Like always, every single time. So instead I just sleep on a silk pillowcase which has yet to fail me yet. And it's also not just good for your hair, it's good for your skin, it's nice and cool. It's just a great experience overall. So I would 12 out of 10 recommend a silk or satin Either one can work. Of course, silk is going to be a lot more expensive, but either silk or satin will both work for your hair and skin. Now, of course, I couldn't wrap up this favorites video without a little bit of curly girl merch. So my girl, Janae, has her apparel line called Nate Too Curly. I've spoken to you guys here on YouTube about this before. This is one of my favorite shirts ever. I was surprised that it wasn't actually in the wash because I wear it so often. And look at how good the quality is, actually, because none of the letters are like coming off and when I tell you I wear this once a week at minimum I wear it once a week so it's getting washed very very frequently I've had it for about almost two years now and with it washing in the machine like I feel like the quality is looking real good anyways I'm about to go ahead and buy me a hair tight pop in sweatshirt because well, I need. But yeah, definitely one of my favorite curly merch lines. Black owned, female owned. Again, also linked in the description box below. But I just love this. Y'all know how I feel about hair typing, right? Like, I just don't think that curls fit in a box. Like, we just don't. Like, even people with hair that's similar to mine are still very different. Do you know what I mean? Like, every curly girl's hair is unique to them. And I feel like that's the special thing. That's just what makes curly hair amazing and dope okay so i actually like to celebrate that which is why i don't usually like to hair type too much i do know that it can be helpful sometimes but you know what like if you got curl any kind of curl kink wave coil whatever hair type pop it the last curly girl merch that i did want to mention is actually something i haven't gotten my hands on yet but i've been eyeing it for the longest time i'm always seeing bianca renee wear them and i'm like girl that's so cute so I'm gonna go ahead and buy it. It is a Canadian company called Curly Prince and they have these sweatshirts and hoodies that say Curly Gang. Just Curly Gang, Curly Gang, Curly Gang, Curly Gang. It is so cute. And I wanna be part of the Curly Gang. I, I, need, I need to be part of the Curly Gang. So like, I should've had this by yesterday. So definitely gonna be snagging one of those for me and also it, I think it's something great. Like it's a cute, really great, like inexpensive gift that you can get for a curly girl that I know like she will absolutely love. So yeah, those are all of my favorite curly girl tools, accessories, and a little curly girl merch at the moment. Genuinely love all of these things and pretty much use all of them very, very frequently. And I 12 out of 10 recommend them for you to treat yourself. I am though very interested in hearing what your favorite favorites are. So if you have any additional curly hair tools, accessories, and other curly girl merch that you really love that you think I should try out next, please comment them below. I don't know. It must be something about the holiday season, but your girl is in a mood to shop. I have a problem, but comment below anyway, because I want to check it all out. And yeah, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. Before you leave, go ahead and make sure you subscribe. I am not saying that there will be a giveaway this holiday season, but there might be. I don't know. I don't want you to miss out on it. So make sure you hit that subscribe button. And while you're at it, the like button is right there too. So just tap that thumbs up while you're there. And I look forward to seeing you in the next one. Bye.